how moved. That was so touching. Virgil! <gasps> they did a number on her, huh? Now she's just an object. Oh, wait. She was already just a tool to begin with. How can you say that? She was trying to protect you. She decided to do that on her own, and then died on her own. Why should I be responsible? Virgil! What about you? You love to go on about Realian rights, but you gave me that code. What made you change your mind? I... I wanted to save you, so I... So you decided to off the Realians? No. It's not like that. What are you embarrassed about? That's basic human instinct. Humans are driven by impulse to destroy. Destruction serves as a way to feel out others and confirm your own existence. Then, you try to find atonement to comfort yourself after you're unable to deny your instincts. I tried to live exactly like that. And you've lived for that same purpose. You disassembled realians and dreamed of giving consciousness to inorganic matter, comforting yourself for the hatred towards your father and anger over your mother's death. You're doing things you don't want to do, just to escape your own feelings of guilt. Hypocrite. The word doesn't even begin to describe you. Be more true to yourself. What makes you think you understand me? Oh, I understand you. Because you and I are the same kind of person. What is it that drives you? <gasps> that's right. Revenge. Only revenge drives you and me, and that's the truth. Ideals crumble easily. Hope is like a mist before the morning sunrise of reality. That's exactly how I was. But then I learned. Nothing will change. There is a limit to will. The limit of this world in which everything is closed. Yes, that is what all of us came to understand. Stop! I don't want to hear anymore! Virgil, you protected me as a child and now... Why do you do these things to tear at my heart? Why do you testaments appear before me? Why won't you leave me alone? Come on, that's not what you really feel. You're glad I still exist. You're happy he still exists. No, no, I... Come, come and you will see. Then choose, choose what you truly desire. You met him, he's with us. I don't understand, he was a testament. I can't just suddenly accept that. That's not what your will is saying. Your heart throbs for him. You feel passion for him. You want to see him, don't you? He wants to see you, too. Stop it! Stop talking to me! Xion, you mustn't listen to him! <laughs> 